Hello everybody, it's Maximus on behalf of Crypto Talk. Now, I did a previous video highlighting how I felt as though that we're going to possibly see bullish momentum for Terra Luna Classic. If you haven't seen the previous video, take a look into it. In a thumbnail, it basically shows a Luna Classic coin slash token riding a bull. It's in the video section. Take a look into it. This video will make a little bit more sense. So without further ado, let's get more into it. So... As you can see right here, Luna Classic's price was on the path of a slow yet steady recovery and had gained levels close to 0 0.00013, which is true. While the bears crashed the price back to 0 0.00011 levels. On the other hand, USTC plunged hard by nearly 15% while Luna's price is struggling hard to sustain above the $2 mark. Again, that's Terra 2.0. The video is going to focus on Luna Classic. Currently, no strong implication of a continued descending trend can be drawn, but the possibility of a rebound is also nullified. That being the case, the possibility of bulls shifting their focus or the retail traders maintaining a safer distance emerges, which is true. Is there any hope for the rejuvenation of the uptrend or the sister tokens could continue to chop within the narrow ranges? Now, with that said, this represents what I pointed out in the previous Luna Classic bullish momentum video so as you can see right here this these pennants and i'm always going to point out when i see pennants i'm not really big on technical analysis and so on but at the end of the day when i see these pennants forming i think it's worthy to point them out so you can see it right here towards the end of that chart on those lines you definitely see sideways consolidation i think that's significant i think these things are particularly good but we want to see uh, a pullback and we want to see the apex start to develop we'll get to that in a moment luna classics price broke the range bound consolidation and surged more than 180 percent since the last week of june which suffered a 30 percent drop during the monthly close since then the asset is trading within the crucial resistance and support zone like i mentioned on the previous video unable to break either of them the recent attempt to break the upper resistance at 0.000129 slash the price again towards the support at 0.00114 from where the price is attempting a rebound currently the Luna classic price is hovering with an ascending triangle again reference back to the previous video very close to the apex and hence an extreme price action is expected before the day's close or during the early trading hours of the upcoming day now in regards to that let's take a look into this so for instance currently speaking at the time of making this video on cmc you see the price at 0 0.001142 it only is down about 1.52 percent but let's face it anything of zero to five percent is sideways action i believe this once this thing says down 10 to 15 percent you're going to see this volume that's currently down 33 percent kick into gear people are going to realize the significance of I guess you could say that sale for that time period um, is going to kick the volume into full gear. If anything, we should see the real test of that apex in an upward trend. That's what I believe. That's what I'm going to state. I'm going to go with that. Um, and then if anything, we could possibly see uh, not necessarily new all-time highs post-crash, but if anything, significant decent pumps, which is good and new support levels uh, that will retest the new levels of resistance. And then from there, hopefully, new consolidation. You guys may disagree with that. You might not like that. But if you've been in this whole crypto game for you know many years and so on, consolidation is a really good thing. It's healthy for the asset. So like, comment, and subscribe if you haven't done so already. Let me know what you think of this. I want to hear from you. So with that said, everybody, thanks for watching today's video on Luna Classic. May all have a blessed day, and we'll see you on the next one.